Abby loves to run around in the garden, go swimming, and she seeks opportunities to meet new people. She also has autism and uses a mix of words and makaton to communicate. Thomas likes playing on the trampoline and loves big hugs. Brass bands are his favourite too. He has a developmental delay, but he talks and can make himself heard. Emma loves listening to classical music and joining in with nursery rhymes. She can say her name and a selection of other words too. She has scoliosis and lives with her parents. Jo lives in London and attends a special needs school. He doesn't talk but is incredibly empathetic and loves to learn. He really enjoys watching YouTube videos on his iPad. Neil lives independently of his parents. He has difficulty walking, but when he visits his family, he really enjoys exploring the Scottish Highlands from his wheelchair. Just like us all, they each love different things, live different lives and are unique from one another, and they all live with Dravet syndrome. Often described as a form of epilepsy, Dravet syndrome is a rare neurological condition that encompasses seizures, learning disability and a spectrum of related conditions. Sambi was diagnosed at 11 months old, Thomas at two years, Emma at 36, Joe was 13 months and Neil was also 36. Because Dravet is a spectrum, their lives have brought them a range of separate challenges and moments of joy. And they've all been part of something together too. They've all been part of Drave Syndrome UK. The charity is dedicated to improving the lives of all those affected by Drave Syndrome through support, education and medical research. Whether a family needs guidance with applying for extra help, wants to meet other families affected by Drave, or learn more about the latest research and medication, there is something for everyone. We want to empower families with knowledge, along with the emotional and financial support they need. Dravet Syndrome UK believes every family counts. If you are a family living with Dravet Syndrome, or know a family who is, and haven't yet joined DS UK, we'd love to hear from you.